நீயில்லாத நாளல்ல நாளாகுமா நீயில்லாத வாழ்வல்ல வாழ்வாகுமா Proverbs chapter 15 verse 3 The Lord is watching every man keeping his eye on both the evil and the good to we can protect ourselves from sin we must always be conscious that god sees us if you are not aware of this truth if you are not mindful that god sees us people will boldly sin if we read through the scripture we can find that many exemplary believers in the bible exhibited this mindfulness that's why they were able to overcome sin and lead an upright life in this world in psalm 16 verse 8 david says i keep my eyes always on the lord with him at my right hand i will not be shaken david was always conscious that god sees joseph is another example he was let down in two pits one as mentioned in genesis chapter 37 verse 24 a pit in his brothers put him but the second pit was more dangerous potiphar's house that was the second pit in proverbs chapter 23 verse 27 the author describes it as a deep pit so lust was more dangerous than the first pit joseph faced we can read that he fled that place in some circumstances fleeing is an act of a coward but at times if we have to flee we must do it in the sight of the world it may look cowardly but in the sight of god that is considered courage joseph fled he may have lost his robe that day but not his character he was even ready to go to jail but wasn't willing to compromise on the character character should be guarded as life dear young brothers and sisters don't lose your character if you lose your character then life will be close to worthless to God of a character we need self control to overcome temptation and be without sin we need to be conscious that god sees us this consciousness will be felt only by the people who are saved only the born again people can feel it so the one who repented and saved will not sin because he is dead to sin he nailed all his desires and lust on the cross a new man the old sin works back in he becomes aware of it and resists if we are not conscious that god sees and are not alarmed at the hint of any temptation and sin then our salvation becomes a question mark so let us be cautious that god sees us and live a holy and upright life the lord may come at any time we must be very cautious hallelujah hallelujah God bless you